Welcome back, girls, guys, and guppies, to Virtuoverse, where hopefully we're nearing the end. <laughs> I'm on a boat, so that much is nice. Uh, uh, what's also nice is playing Jay, but um, right now I'm a bit stuck on like what to do. I saw some marks on the wall in the cabin. What marks? In the cabin near the bed. Someone's been counting days. Ah! Probably the ship boy. Uh, really? Sounds more like someone, something a prisoner would do. Yeah, that boy complained all the time. He was always counting the days until he could return home and be a slacker again. Hmm, there's probably more to it. Uh, sorry, that's me. Hmm, there's probably more to it you're not telling me. There's nothing more. He was just a slacker. Ha! This story sounds really strange. I don't want to know anything more about it. A fucking giant octopus is blocking the missile pod. What? Yes. What? There is a monster in the water. There. Blocking the missile pod. It's sitting on top of it. A kraken? A octopus, you say? Yes. That's no problem. Get it off, sir. What? Just make it go away. Get some bait. And... Distract him. Bait? Yes, try to lure him with something to eat. Tie the food to the submarine and pull away when he sees the food. I mean, yes, I already came up with that. How about a better plan? You can also offer yourself as food. Yeah, I'll go get some bait. Oops. I'm on a boat. Yes. Exactly. I'm still preparing the bait. Monsters like food. You create the bait. You attach it to the submarine. You can go to the octopus, and you make it go away. Yeah, easy. I'm off. I need to take care of some things. Bye. So, let's fish. Um, oh, I can use the, the lead thing on this. I guess. It came up empty. So, let's use the lead. Just no. Oh, come on. I had such a good idea. So, let's go to another place where maybe it looks more like fish are there. Set sail to plunder. This looks like fish, doesn't it? Oh, <laughs> that's a lot of fish. Pick up fish. All right, I got those. Let's see what we have here. I'm no fisherman, but it looks like one of these fish is carrying eggs. Fish with eggs. Fish. Good idea, but I need to finish the fishing tool first. How do I finish that? I got the eggs. Sorry about that, little buddy. Okay. Oh, we just threw the sturgeon away. Cool. Okay, okay, I'm going to bed. Okay. <laughs> Good night, Louise. <laughs> I don't really like your idea. Oh, no. Okay, what the fuck do I use the eggs for, then? Captain. Yes. Never mind. Um... Can I use... Nothing useful here. Can I... Okay, I guess that really was just for, um... The content. Open... Use bedside table? It's locked. Use the knife. On the bedside table. That sounds too violent to me. I want to get in the fucking bedside table. Use the fish eggs. <laughs> yeah, I know it's nonsense. Look at photo. A beautiful lady. Maybe a relative of the captain's. Uh, okay. Can we ask him about her? Will that do anything? Captain! What do you want, pirate? Is that a photo of your wife? Ah! We have a lurker in the cabin. 
I wasn't lurking in your cabin. Yes, you were lurking in my cabin. Ha! No, I wasn't. What's the matter? Nothing. Sure there is by your reaction. What's the problem? Problem? I didn't say that. And that's not my wife. That was the ship boy. There was a ship boy here? An ungrateful one, I might add. He disappeared some time ago. Disappeared? Yes. And the ship has been a miss. A mess since he left. I have no time to take care of it. You don't look super busy right now. What? I'm busy all the time. Looking out for danger. And keeping the ship on course. And riding the ship's log. And... And staring at the sea all day. Arr. Okay. Um... Let's give him something to do. So, I have fish. That's good. But, I... Is that a fucking whale? I caught enough fish already. Okay. Okay, so I guess that's just background decoration. Possibly dive somewhere else. Where's your moderator? Does he bring his eco glass bottles to the deposit machine again with his eco car? I don't know what you're referring to. <laughs> fish I don't like your idea okay player's choice player's choice is not an angry moderator as a general note I don't think it's nice to talk about people who aren't there I'd uh, appreciate that not being done what the hell do I do? Wait, I, so she didn't want to cook the eggs. She didn't want to cook the fish. What do I do with fish eggs? I don't know what the fish eggs are for, and I'm stumped on this. Man, I had such a good idea. So if I do this, she tells me I need to finish the fishing tool first. So I need some sort of an angle, like a, like a actual fishing rod type of thing. For what though? What am I missing? <laughs> Coffee machine. Hmm. 
Need to get rid of the Wikipedia article for for Ursa Major. Okay, I hmm. I don't have that much to work with. I don't know what to do. Should I go diving? I'll go diving in another place. Okay, that's not interactable. Uh. Set sail the plunder. I mean, I have no real, I don't know where to go diving. Maybe I'll go dive next to that whale. <laughs> I can't let go of this, it just looks really, like, it looks like I should... It looks like it should be something, doesn't it? Let's try it. Or is she gonna tell me she doesn't want to use the submarine here? Oh no, okay. Fish, fish. <laughs> Coke can. I'm surprised they can actually go diving here. It's a crab! It ran away. Oh god. That's actually a dead whale. I did not ex- <gasps> A hook! I did not look that up, by the way. I followed my intuition. Lead wire. Yes! Okay, okay, okay. So I was actually missing some shit. Okay, that, but that's all I can pick up. Do I need this crab? Or is that just a red herring? We'll see, we'll see. I'll just, I'll, I'll, I'll put the stuff together. Come on, Jay. I don't know if I need the crab. Okay, so. Wait. Oh, is that in the, is that in the cargo bay now? I'm taking the hook from within. I'm taking the lead wire. Okay. So. That's a bad idea. Okay. I don't know how to tie a proper knot for it. Oh, come on. Then, what, really? Yes, read the fucking knot book. When I was a kid, I knew how to tie a few basic knots. I wasn't good at it. What, the fucking what? Okay. It doesn't sound like a plan to, why not, Jay? Why not? Okay, can you ask the captain about knots? Cause he should, he probably read the book, right? Captain, yes. Can you please help me with the knot? Ah ha 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 ha! Girl can't do the knot. Captain Wildenberg will teach her. Step back, ha! 
Okay, do I have to write that down? I will write down the... the thing. Pay attention now. I'm listening. It is that easy. I cannot, I, I can't tell shit from this. Uh. <laughs> this is a, this is just pixel madness. Okay, let's see if she can do it. It's so easy, even you can do it, ha. Huh? Okay, I think I can do that. Ha ha ha, cool, now I'm a knot master. Cool, I'm glad it's that easy. Okay, let's see if she can actually do that. Oh, she did it, okay. Hook with cord and plumb. All right, so fish eggs. What, what is a lead wire for? Okay, I want to go, I want to go get the crab. <laughs> so, let's see if I can put the lure. The bait is nearly complete, but without something to eat, it will never work. I know, that's why we're trying to... Can I... I can't... Okay. Hmm. Yes, there is need to put it in the cargo bay. Sure it will work. I'm going to go I'm going to go check what if I can get the crab first anyway. Oh, I get it. I need the lead because it needs to like be bogged down. Okay. Let's try for the crab again. I wonder if it's contaminated with everything else here. I run away. Whatever. I'm too excited to see what happens when I lure the octopus. Is there a death state in this game? <laughs> Hello. Use octopus. <laughs> He's ignoring the bait. Maybe it's not tasty enough for him. Uh, great. I need the fucking crab, don't I? God damn it. Not tasty enough for him. Put the octopus in the cargo bay. <laughs> Louise, you're still here. <laughs> Super cargo bay. Open the cargo bay. Take items from cargo bay. But I mean, she said she was done. She's not going to add the eggs to it now, is she? Bait is back home. I really like your idea. Just know. I'm a better mobile data. <laughs> I don't know what to do. He probably he he wants he wants the crab for sure, but like skinning knife. Well, I mean, I guess I already used the knife on the sturgeon. 
I'm the, which I guess makes me the sturgeon surgeon. <laughs> I'm super comfy, but I was having too much fun to start anyway. <laughs> I appreciate it. I've I've been enjoying the company. <laughs> okay, so I guess we're getting back to like seeing if we can catch the crab. And if I can't think of a think of a different like can't think of anything, I'll use a walkthrough. Cause god damn it, I just wanna be done with this game. So I can't put this in there. And if I use the fishing net here, it doesn't do anything, does it? I caught enough fish already. Okay, she doesn't want to do that. Uh, do I need to block the way? There's no need to put it in the cargo bay. What really is too violent for me? What do I do? What do I do to get a crab? Because I can't, I can't access my inventory while I'm in the water, so I have to go down with everything prepped. And I don't have anything left to do down here. Can I turn the butt of the submarine towards the crab? They ran away. I wanna look it up. I don't care. I don't care enough. Uh, talk, set sail again, go to the under, get on a submarine dive all the way to the base again, go to the kitchen room we visited, use a spot on the lead wire on the pot, towel on the pot. Uh, wait, so I don't need to get the crab? I'm gonna look for the crab in this walkthrough. Crab. Use a missile compass. He will tell you. Talk to Captain Wildenberg again and tell him that the octopus is blocking the way. He will tell you that you need to create a bait. We refer to the book that we have to have about fish, the Great Fishing Compendium. To know that what we're going to need. Crab, shrimp, and fish. Oh, I guess. Okay. And we're setting sail to. Okay, I have the shrimp in the can, I guess? Uh, upon arriving there, interact with the fishnet. Use the eggs on the bottle. Wait, didn't I try that already? Uh, keep going down, you see the crab. Ah! Oh! Okay. I do still have the eggs, yes. But I thought I had interacted with the bottle. I guess I didn't try everything. I thought I'd interacted, like, had everything in my inventory interacted with everything. I guess I didn't. Getting a bit sloppy because I'm impatient. Okay, I mean, I'm always impatient, let's be honest. Okay, so that worked. Can I put that in the cargo bay now? I can. Okay, so I did, I did need bait for um for the crab. Okay, let's see. Now rocks. Use rocks. I put the fish eggs on the rocks. Crab on the rocks. Yum, yum, yum. Got the crab. Yay. You have at least 20 times more patience than I. I appreciate that. <laughs> I do not, I cannot by any stretch of the imagination consider myself an, a patient person with things like this. I do, I mean, I'm not gonna like, 
say I'm the least patient with everything, but I don't... I don't like to fiddle with the same thing for long stretches of time. Where's the crab? Oh wait, it's in the cargo bay, I'm an idiot. Taking the crab from within. Okay. I dumped one more bottle in the ocean. Oh my god, I'm just skewering it. Okay. Let me read this. It appears to contain a text, but more. Hmm. There's a chapter about cephalopods. Let's check. There's a section about eating habits. Interesting. Fish, shrimp, crab. Those are their favorite kinds of food. Hmm. Looks like crabs are really into fish eggs. Ah, uh, okay. I could have learned from that. Okay. So, I still don't have... Shrimp. Do I? I mean, I guess it's a shrimp. Whatever. We'll try it. We'll, we'll just try it now. I've never really played point-and-click games because I'm impatient. Yes, so this bait will attract the monster. Okay, if you're that confident, let's go. I would say... Like, point-and-clicks used to be my favorite alongside Metroidvanias, or like, jump and run, as you used to call them. Uh, at least in Germany, I don't know if that was a thing in the US as well, whatever. Um, but then, when I died two to three times in one spot, I'm over it. <laughs> See, that for me, doesn't it depend on, like, the game for you, though? Because, like, I played Cuphead, and I played it with a passion, and I died a lot on some levels, because that's the, that's, that's what that game do. Um, but I didn't mind it. I would quit the game and, like, start it back up ten minutes later. <laughs> but I guess that's not really Metroidvania. It's not a Metroidvania, but it's a side-scroller. Oh wait, I'm diving in the wrong spot, aren't I? Oh, this is this is oh, this is too much telasophobia for me. No, 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 no. Hollow Knight really tried my patience. Some oh yeah, but that game is so good. I mean, that's preaching to the choir, right? But um, I did end up beating it. Did you beat it like all the way through? Because I still haven't done that. I'm I'm I could, but I've never gotten to the final final boss. Or well. I've gotten there, but I tried it once, and then I was like, I need I need to do something else. <laughs> so that's the thing, I have so much playtime in Hollow Knight, and I, I haven't even, like, I've found everything, I've collected everything, etc, etc. You got credit roll. Well, there's four endings, right? And I think the final final boss is in the original game, I think. But yeah, I haven't finished um, all the DLCs yet either. The God um, Pantheon. I'm still missing that one. Okay, let's try it. Let's try it. Hey, buddy boy. You likey? He's ignoring the bait. Fuck. Where the fuck do I get shrimp? You just did the one? Okay, yeah. That's fair enough. I need to kind of watch out here for um, email. Okay, actually, guys, I think. Hold on, let me. No, I have another half an hour. <laughs> I want to send it Ender Lilies, and although it's not a Metroidvania, 100% Terraria. I haven't, I don't think I've even heard of Ender Lilies, and I've never played Terraria, although ha I have it. I think, actually, uh, one of you nice people here in my stream community actually gifted me Terraria at some point. Okay, so... More lead. Wait, did the game glitch? Why am I putting more lead in this? I can't leave with this hot molten light in my- I better put everything back. Okay. Pick up 
pick up another shrimp can. God damn it! Where the fuck do I get shrimp? Terraria is the best money I've ever spent on Steam. Oh yeah? Oh, maybe I do need to finally give it a go. Also, people have really, really been praising Subnautica. I haven't dared to play that yet, because I like- I- oh. I fucking hate the ocean, man. <laughs> I'm fine at like this distance of pixelatedness, and I like going swimming in it, but as soon as I think of it, like, hold up. This is- this is not okay. Um, hey! Welcome! Welcome the OH. <laughs> Hi, Oli. What up, what up? Thanks for checking in. Um, look at Flag. The wind is blowing strong today. So maybe he can tell me where to get shrimp. No? Where the fuck do I get shrimp? I definitely got spooked. Yeah, I can imagine. Especially because, like, I'm fine with... I know it's like exploration mainly and then somebody made the decision to like add in things that can actually hurt you and at that point I'm out like no no nothing scarier to me than to have like a first person view with a limited periphery and then to be like oh that's the sea monster okay no 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 Ta -da. Okay, um... What if all those sea monsters just want a hug? <laughs> then they probably press too hard. They're like, oh look, it's the teddy bear. <laughs> hug each other, yes! <laughs> Go give that other scary thing a hug. Exactly. <laughs> Don't we all need Viking girlfriend to protect us? But you know what? I 100% agree with you. I do not know. I'm not 100% on whether I want to be her or be with her. I think I'm leaning more towards the want to be her side. But yeah. Oh god, there actually is an unopened one. Oh my god. Can I at least use the fucking knife? I'm against violence. Okay, so how do I open it then? That's a bad idea, she says. All of this is a bad idea. Can I throw this in there? No. Okay. Fuck. Can I just put the fucking... I mean, it's an octopus. Can't he just crush the can? That would cause some serious damage. This is a point and click adventure? Yes, it's called a Virtual Verse, and it's a point and click game that very decidedly uh, aims to imitate old school, like proper old school, like late 80s, early 90s, mid 90s point and click. Meaning, its puzzles are aggravating, its pacing is weird, and the dialogue is sociopathic. Um, all of that is very intentional. Okay, please tell me I can just put this on the hook. I can! Oh my god! Thank you! Thank you! Something was easy for once. I still don't know why the lead thing is... I don't know. Yeah, if I could pull it off. I'd like to be here, but in reality I just wanted to protect me and cuddle. Aww. <laughs> I did go to, like, a festival with, um... Uh, hold up. Can I find the pictures of it? I, d I went to like a, like a Ren Faire type thing dressed as a Viking ones. Hold up, let me see if I can find it. My costume really wasn't that epic because I didn't, <laughs> I didn't feel like investing the money. <laughs> uh, 
But, uh, you know, I did the best with what I had. Let's see if I can find that. Hold up, hold up. I don't know if I ever put those pictures on my PC or if they just stayed on my phone. <laughs> if they stayed on my phone, that's gonna be fun to look up. Oh, hold up, I think I put it up on some social media thing at some point. Can I... Yes! Come on, don't let me down. <laughs> the quest for the Viking picture. The quest for the Viking picture. This was a while ago. This was pre-COVID. This was the last time we went to that thing pre-COVID. Uh, there it is. And now, I need to... Whoop. My stream is frozen. Where's my stream frozen? Is it frozen for you? It's frozen for me. No. It's back. It's back. Okay, now I need to like... <laughs> set up a screen grab. That is not... Hold up. Mmm... Ow, I just poked myself in the head with an open pen. I am, ooh, I'm smart. All right, mm, let us see. Cause I'm trying not to broadcast my personal Instagram and I don't know how to edit a scene that I'm not on. <laughs> okay, uh, or, or. Sounds complicated. I know, right? Okay, hold up. This is look 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 at the links I go to for you, Louise. <laughs> uh So this is the first one, I guess. I'll just take a fucking screenshot and do a Nope, that was the <laughs> that was the wrong thing. That was the wrong thing. Um, and hold up, fenced out of Nama. There it is. And can I like no? Screenshot. Friend of him. Fenster. No, that's the wrong one. That's the one. Ta da! <laughs> that was worth the wait, wasn't it? Thanks, Ollie. I did those myself, actually. Haha. <laughs> so that's one. And then, oh, hold up, maybe I can make, if I just have this one up, that would mean I can pull up a new one, couldn't I? Yes! That's a side view, and then actually my favorite picture from, from this is... Yeah, 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 because you, cause you, have, you have access to my private Instagram and, and, and Facebook, Ollie, so yeah, you, sh you probably saw this. You probably saw this one, which I think is my favorite out of that series. <laughs> Just casually leaning next to some flowers. <laughs> oh, hey, those pictures look familiar. Yes, and here we have the photographer showing up in our chat. <laughs> But yeah, yeah, I'm fairly, I, I, I really got into the, the makeup on that one. I really enjoyed it. Anyway, let's get back to this. I don't know what to do with the lead in the stove. That's a bad idea. I agree, Jay. I think, 
I think the game just glitched out on me, honestly. Cause like, I was, I was very like, I thought it was very weird that I had, suddenly had a pot of lead uh, earlier. Okay, yeah, this, I, I wasn't supposed to, I can't leave with this whole, oh right, sorry, sorry about that, Jay. Um, I don't think I was supposed to have the lead that early on. Cause I, I had no source of the lead. I think the game just bugged. Clearly I did the most work for those photos. Yes, yes, indeed. Quite, quite. The true artist. Oh. <laughs> I was but a humble sub uh, object. Best, m best meal for the mollusk ever. The monster will like it. <laughs> but yeah, that's, that's, that's as close as I got to, to Viking Girlfriend. <laughs> Will you take this now, please? It's working. Here, boy, come here. Oh god, that is so scary. What do we do with it now? I should drop the bait now. What? The submarine is not releasing it. I'm fucked. Captain Shay, do you copy? I repeat, do you copy? <laughs> I have to reach the boat. I need help. Oh god. Oh shit. <laughs> oh, oh no. I done goofed. I done goofed. I just gotta protect me. <laughs> Fuck, I'm trapped here. I should get back to the base and try to contact the guys. Mm. Yep, I guess so. The poor weird captain who killed his wife boy. The bait worked, but I'm stuck in the missile base. I have to complete my mission though. The blade will find a way to rescue me, I hope. Okay. So, now that the guy is gone, the, the octopus is gone, we can launch the missile. <laughs> Captain Ryder <Ryan or> died. <laughs> and we're still casually cooking some lead on the stove. Nothing wrong with that, nothing wrong with that. I'm sure that won't go horribly wrong. Alright, it's loading. Let's see. Hold up, I'm gonna shove my stream lamps over there again. Okay, that turned green. Good, the missile is ready to launch. I just have to find a way to contact the guys at the base to warn them. Okay. <laughs> For the aroma. Yes. Mmm. Oh man, I'm having so much fun, but I have to get off uh, in a few minutes because I have like a. I have to get to rehearsal, and before that I have to have, to have a Zoom meeting. Maybe I can use this device to contact the base. How would you know to... Oh, it's a smiley face. Oh. It's Ramirez. Ramirez, this is Jay. The floppy is loaded and I'm ready to launch. Okay, keep this channel open. There's just one problem. I'm stuck here. What do you mean? It's a long story. There was a giant octopus here, and the boat is gone. Destroyed. A giant octopus? What the hell? Anyway, are you safe now? Yes, I'm safe and ready to proceed. Please send somebody. I'm trapped here. Don't worry. We are coming to get you out of there ASAP. Uh, was it Jay? Is everything okay? Yes. We are sending somebody to rescue her. Rescue her? What happened? Don't worry. Everything is under control. The missile is ready to launch and she will be back here soon. Okay, so what should we do now? Now, now. There's one more thing we need to do. Before you go, you need to get chipped with permanent reality. What? Wait, why? There's no other way to access the tourist point. The flight tickets only work with your personal chipset. And there's no way around it. At least not with such little time. I don't want that shit in my head. I told you there's no other way. We'll get that chip out of your head once we're done. Besides, 
If everything goes as planned, the chip will become obsolete and inactive. Alright, it's not like I have much of a choice anyway. Nope. No, just come here. It's really quick. Okay! Wow, that was fast. Sure, that's because this is a basic version of the chipset. Using the source code, we were able to disable most of its features. But it should still work with your for your trip up to space. This is untested, but in theory you should be able to reach the station without Xenon even noticing your presence. So you're saying you just dropped a chip in my head that hasn't even been tested? Oh man, stop complaining. It's all good. It's safe. Oh, all right. Anything else? That is all. She looked like she was gonna shoot him. Yeah, right? <laughs> Once you're up there at the tourist point, just call us back and we'll start the DDoS attack. Okay, I'm going. Let's do this. Here's the ticket. Here's a radio. Call us when you're ready so we can launch the DDoS attack. Zack will escort you to the spaceport by car. Okay, Zach, let's go. <laughs> yes, exactly. Oh, oh yeah, the, the hand is different. It feels really strange being permanently checked, but there is no other way. I should be able to reach the station's tourist area, but that's obviously the easy part. Once I'm up there, I have to start the DDoS attack. That should let me access the space station stop Xenon. I look comfy, but I don't need to rest right now. It's MIB. We don't want any trouble here. Oh, I would like to check in. Of course. Take it, please. Here it is. Okay. The next flight is in 30 minutes. When you are ready, there's tickets there on the right. Oh, how much baggage can I bring? Each piece of baggage has a maximum size of... 158 centimeters and a maximum weight of two. <laughs> okay, not much has changed since our times, huh? On that front. And a maximum weight of 23 kilograms. No uncertified electronic devices are allowed. Uh, I don't have any strange electronics with me. I see. Wait, you're carrying objects that exceed the limit of hand for hand baggage. I'm sorry, sir, but before you board, you will need to leave the following items here. <laughs> Junk. Rusty saw, <laughs> shovel. <laughs> okay, uh, no problem. Please place everything in behind the ticket counter. An operator will pick everything up. Uh, immediately. Cool. Fewer items to deal with. Done. Okay, thank you. You may now proceed to the boarding area. Have a nice trip. Security is very high around here. Showing satellite view of the country. Damn. Seems like a cold front is coming soon. I hate winter. Oh. You guessed right. It's fake. Jar is full of plastic materials. I won't find anything useful here. Is that the same? Sure. Okay. Tourists. Look at tourists. I think they're waiting for the next trip. The last diagram you sent me is wrong. What do you mean? A Z function generates a lot of entropy in the data. Uh, maybe I didn't check the integrity of the database constraints before running the process. I won't even try to insert myself into this conversation. Okay, good. Fine. Let's go up. His girlfriend is cooler. I guess Viking girlfriend too. She would have gotten Captain Ryder I too, but you know. <laughs> Wait, what's happening here? Wait, 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 wait. Ticket. Okay. Oh, this is just a cutscene. Okay. Guys, I think we did it. Are we gonna finish this game? Am I gonna be able to start another game next time?
Welcome to the Space Station's tourist area, gentlemen. Please follow me as you, I show you the way to the sightseeing point. Before I start, allow me to ask you something. Do you have any background knowledge about the space station? For instance, do you know what the original module was? Yes, that's common knowledge. <laughs> the space station was originated on the international project called ISS. Correct! But what you don't know is, most of the original modules are still part of the station's core structure, even though what we see now is a completely revamped version of them. All those modules are still, here, still there. Do you mean Xenon still relies on old hardware? Not exactly. Most of the old hardware is unused now. It has been integrated with completely new and modern technology. However, some old components are still working. Some of the old devices are also st stored here in the museum. So you mean that everything is automated now? What's performing maintenance? Most of it is run by nanobots. Xenon is even capable of building new modules. But interestingly, until now, Xenon hasn't modified much. Xenon has the technical potential to do it, though. I need to keep going. I have no time for tourism. So unlimited, there's only one destination. This place. Ugh. Okay. Emergency box. Open in case of fire. Warning. Opening this box will trigger the alarm. Oh, let's avoid doing suspicious things anywhere people are present. Do not open luggage when airlock doors open. Smoking is prohibited throughout the tourist area. I forgot where I need to go. <laughs> motherboard. Pick up motherboard. What? <laughs> I'm just taking shit? <laughs> okay. Oh, sure. Let's just... We'll build a tower, I guess. And the ram. Now I can build a computer. <laughs> Where's the motherboard? Does that seem to work like that? Why not? It should work like that. It, that's what the motherboard is for. Okay, whatever. We'll deal with that later. It appears to be from a previous age. Okay, starting to lose it. I'm <laughs> glad I got to start. Stay for it. 100% worth of Viking cosplay. Ah. <laughs> okay, sleep well, Louise. Thank you for, uh, thanks for hanging out. Moon Project 91. Debunking landing conspiracy theories since 2020. <laughs> Full of historical oddities. Very interesting. It's displaying a 3D view of the solar system. The positions of the bodies are updated daily using satellite data. That's cool. He's holding the helmet with pride. First Uranus mission, 100th anniversary. He's wearing a suit like the other one, whatever. I wonder if it's even the same. He has a badge with his name on it, but it's too small. I can't read it. First Uranus mission, 100th anniversary. Look, it's a loving memory of Edwin Hubble and Arthur Eddington. Okay, can I do look at metal? Uh, okay. Oh, I still have my towel. Wowie, so happy. Radio. Oh. Oh, uh, base. This is Nathan. Solid copy. This is base. I'm inside this tourist trap and I'm ready to proceed. Perfect. Let us know when we can launch the DDoS. Okay, guys. Start the DDoS attack. Oh, look at those luscious lips on Ramirez. Mmm. Eh! Oh, gosh! Oh no. Okay. 
I don't know what I took those computer parts for. And I don't know what I do now. What is happening? Help! This is an emergency! Let's go to the airlock. I guess I'm not getting into the airlock, huh? Axe. Pick up axe. I'm gonna build myself a nice PC. Exactly! I don't know what I did that for. Uh, use sliding door. Okay, don't panic now. The escape pods, pods will take us back to Earth. Hey, seriously, thanks for stranding me here. Don't worry, new pods should already be on their way. W wow, that's perfect. I'll be waiting here. I do want to die. Oh, shut up. Okay. Ejection. Okay, this played out easy. They were so scared that they didn't even care about me. Let's find a way to the space station now. This worked out pretty smooth. I'm alone in the tourist area now, but all the pods have been used. I gotta find another way to reach the station. Knobs. Use knobs. Maybe the axe. Yes, nice axe, man. Better read the warning signs before touching those. Caution. Room depressurization control system. The system should be operated by authorized personnel only. Unauthorized operations may lead to life-threatening hazards. I'm not fiddling with those. If the room's pressure drops while I'm in here without the right equipment, I'll die. True, 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 true. This airlock is all that's separating me from certain death out in space. I can't open it with my bare hands. Okay, fair enough. Uh, wait, I just read that. What time is it? I need to go, I need to go, but I'm almost done! God damn it! Look at Space Station. Who of all evil is there? What can I do? What the fuck do I have? That's nonsense. Use the axe on the ram. Use the axe on... Can I take the- oh wait, can I- Yeah, man! Great. Boom, baby! And... Can I... Fluff. Handle. Pick up handle. Is that it? That's all I can take? Biggest example of that er uh, earlier in the game was picking up a ladder and just stuffing it into his jacket. Although he was only willing to do that through one room. Good old point and click, yep. Okay, let's use the suit. There's no need to wear it here. Are you kidding me, Nathan? Handle. Are you sure? Yes, I'm sure. See how the suit fits. Thank you. So glad he got to still keep his hoodie on. Well, it could have been worse. And here it goes. Let's go to the server room. Good thing he knows how to navigate in a spacesuit. There's something blocking the entrance. I can't open it. Damn. Let's call the base. Hey, the door is locked. Then find another way in. Check the other entrances. Okay, I'm on my way. Okay, that was easy. It might be deactivated, but better not touch anything. I think this was where people slept when the station was still manned. 
Floating robot. See if this is still, 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 thing still works. Please stand by, setting up. Today is day seven hundred seventy-seven thousand. No, I can't read. Seventy-seven thousand seven hundred and forty-three in orbit. Last login six hundred fifty-eight days ago. Scanning critical systems routines. Average station temperature is 20 degrees Celsius. Oxygen level low. Humidity 10%. Basic structure modification detected. Seven organic life forms detected on board. Starting interactive mode. Hello, what a beautiful day. Oh, hello, and you are? I'm Zaymon, and I'm in charge of this station. Doesn't really look like you're in the boss here anymore. It's been a long time since my last session. Anything to report? I don't even know where to start, Zaymon. Long story short, some AI took control of everything, including the space station. People becoming alienated in separate virtual worlds. On Earth, reality is being systematically replaced, and I'm here to stop it and save the world. In a nutshell, we gotta destroy the station. Care to help? Hmm. Computing. 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 Everything okay, Zaymon? Computing. This is really unfortunate. Your statements pose a threat to the security of this station. I need you to follow me. Immediately. Oh, uh, wait. Maybe you don't understand the big picture here. I do. I can calculate millions of possible events per second. I'm aware of the big picture more than any average human being. Please follow me to the command center. Command center, you said? All right, let's go. Please follow me. This way. Cool. I'm sorry for the inconvenience. I'm just following the proto- What is this? What's happening here? W what are you talking about? Blood everywhere. Cables like veins. What? This is horrible. This is hell. I don't see anything, Zayman. Yikes. Hey, wait, what the hell? Wow, that was crazy. Looks like he's seen a ghost or a monster. Something strange is going on here. Better keep my eyes open. Quite a good laptop, even if it's a bit outdated. The battery looks like it's dead. Okay, guys, I gotta leave because <laughs> I have a I have an online meeting in five minutes. <laughs> but I'm. It really looks like we're like just about to finish this game. So depending on when I get home tonight, I'll finish it. And if I don't, then I'll probably finish it tomorrow. Uh, but for now, I'm gonna go offline. Thank you for joining me. As always, I was quite surprised by how many people actually came at this time of day. And uh, I'll see you next time. This done. Cheers! And thank you, Ollie. Bye!